Hello, everyone. Thanks for the chance to present my talk in 2022 SMAP. Usually, there is a possible steep learning curve for users with limited knowledge of bioinformatics to use new tools, especially for those who are not familiar with the programming basics and the dash shell in a Linux environment. At the most of times, bioinformaticians do hope to further develop their tools, making it more user-friendly including trying to remove and simplify the middle steps. Unfortunately, it's not that easy or straightforward to provide a one-click solution due to the incompatibility of the various tools and the database plug different database plugins. Thus, I believe that a step-by-step -step protocol guide is necessary to assist users focusing their science and saving their pings on installing and applying the software itself. I want to start with story. Once a day, I was writing late at midnight. Then I heard the noise, both from upstairs and downstairs, including the party noise, the full step noise. I quickly took out a paper from the drawer named Protocol for Non-Nature Noise Control in Nocturnal Animal. After following the each step listed on this paper. In a moment, the noise quieted down. I re then I can re-enjoy re my piece of writing that night. The fast evolving pandemic did bring challenges for friendly and quiet neighborhood community, especially when people spending more time at home offering chances to disturb disturbing other rest time. However, few publications can be found to work through the specific noise complaint steps, including the troubleshooting section. As the bioinformatician has been involved in many projects, dealing these projects can produce many challenges. Overcoming these challenges means progress. And there are better ways to spread the middle steps work, such as which method you choose, how you proceed the analysis, and what if the outcome is unexpected. They are, you, these are very useful to assist the future users to use and improve the bioinformatic tools. For example, this is a middle step work for bioinformatic tools, HS Defender. It is designed for identifying HSDs in eukaryotic genomes by using BLAST package. PF domain and KGG pathway. We highlighted the steps in a graphical abstract and assisted with examples, which greatly cut down the barrier for the first time user to use this tool. Here is another example. It is small but practical web tool. It can be proceeded either online or locally. Annotating protein coding genes can be challenging, especially when searching for the best hits against multiple functional databases. No better words combiner can strengthen the gene definition by minimizing those protein function discretion containing the better words, such as hypothetical on uncharacterized proteins, so as to polish the gene annotations. Same to HS Defender. We guided users to prepare their own input files step-by-step -step in a graphical abstract, including the possible running errors and the software compatibility and so on. This is another middle step work. As its name stands, it is used for cross and fine scale tuning of large protein sequence phylogenetic database where uh, minimization of OTU redundancy. The step -by -step this step-by-step -step protocol is very timely to tidy up the tree construction steps, in including aligning and trimming and building. This is also very helpful for myself in, ter in terms of documentation. Nowadays, many biomedics related questions could be found via BioStars, GitHub, or Stackflow website. This is same to seek the noise complaint questions from Google, Reddit, and other discussion platforms. At the very last, I want to thank for the sponsors to 